Hey everyone, Dr. Lewis Grin, family medicine physician. With the upcoming holiday season, I bet a lot of you are going to be traveling. And with that travel may come the requirement to show a COVID-19 vaccine immunization card. Some of you may have to show this in order to travel at all, depending on what country you're in. Others might have to show it to avoid having a COVID PCR test done or to avoid quarantining. Now, I'm going to show you how to create a secure digital copy of your COVID-19 vaccine information card so that you don't have to take the paper copy with you all the time and risk losing it. Now, I'm going to be doing this demonstrating off of the Cerner Healthy Life portal as well as the Epic patient portal onto my iPhone. Sorry, I don't have an Android laying around. I'm not an Android kind of guy. Um, however, I imagine the process will look very similar to what I'm gonna demonstrate using the iPhone. All right, let's get started. Okay, the first thing you're gonna do is wanna go ahead and get logged into your patient portal. And then at least within the Cerner Healthy Life portal, which is what I'm demonstrating right now, you're gonna to go to health records. And then at the bottom, you'll see COVID Center. If you'll click on that, this will pull up information about your vaccines, your COVID vaccines that have been recorded by your health system. In the middle there, you're going to see where it says view vaccine verification. You'll click on that and it's gonna generate the QR code that you're gonna then scan to move that information over to your mobile phone. In the case of iOS, you're going to move this into your wallet app that is standard on all iOS phones. Like I said, I don't use Android, so I'm not exactly sure where it goes on the Android phone. From this view, you also have the opportunity to print a vaccine card as well. So now I'm gonna move over to my mobile phone. Okay, when you're ready and your QR code has been generated on the screen, you're gonna hold your mobile phone camera up to the screen and it's going to recognize it. You're then gonna tap where it says health, in this case again for iOS, and then you'll add to wallet and health, and it'll give you a confirmation that it has been added. And now you securely have your information in your phone. And if you go to your wallet app on the iPhone, you'll see your vaccination cards added to your wallet app. That will then generate a QR code that can be scanned by an individual who needs to verify your information and that you need to share it with, such as a governmental agency or anyone else who you need to share that information with to avoid any travel restrictions. Now I'm gonna quickly show you where to find this information on the Epic portal. If you look under, if you look on your main page, you should see a spot that says stay up to date on your COVID-19 status with vaccination test results and more. If you'll click that, that will then take you to your COVID-19 page within the Epic portal. And again, from there, you can generate the QR code that you can scan to show that your vaccines have been completed. Again, you'll add that to your smartphone, just like I demonstrated in the previous workflow from the Cerner patient portal. The workflow on your iPhone is gonna be exactly the same. I hope this video was helpful uh, in showing you how to put your COVID vaccine card information onto your smartphone. Hopefully it comes in handy this holiday season if you do have to travel. I do encourage you to get vaccinated if you haven't been vaccinated. I also encourage you to continue to wear your mask, especially if you're in crowded indoor spaces or if you're on public transportation this holiday season, it's still required to wear your mask on all trains, planes, and buses in the United States. And I'm sure a lot of other countries have those restrictions as well. And as always, be safe out there.